An unspeakable tragedy for a family in northern Oakland County. A deadly fire ripped through their home in Rose Township, killing a mother, father, and their two boys. Two other family members were left badly burned. 7 Action News reporter Amira David spoke to people in the neighborhood who are simply heartbroken. Amira. Well, I want to step aside so you can see behind me, just in front of me, you can see uh, state police and also fire crews uh, working on an investigation right now. This was just a tragic end to the holiday weekend for this family, for the community, leaving neighbors here to wake up to the news in shock. I'm just sad. <laughs> that's, that's all there is to it. I'm sad. I mean, it's an awful tragedy. Neighbors in this small Rose Township community feeling the sting after a nearby home went up in flames. Fire crews responded to this trailer on Wakewood Court around 530 this morning. When they arrived on the scene, they say the home was already engulfed in flames with a family of four trapped inside. We do believe it was uh, two boys uh, around the ages of two and five and a male and a female around the age of 25 years. But two others in the home were able to escape and are being treated at area hospitals. One is the grandfather and owner of the home, reportedly in critical condition right now with severe burns, while the other is a cousin now in stable condition. This woman who didn't want her face shown says she knew the family well and is shaken up. I have a two year old grandson that's the same age as matter of fact is the two year old that passed, so it, it hits home hard. The fire authority says the flames were a challenge. With limited hydrants in the area, they enlisted the help of neighboring communities with 25 to 30 personnel working to get the fire extinguished. Having uh, multiple deaths like this is definitely um, something that uh, the guys and girls have to deal with. So. And the fire chief says at this point they do not have a cause for this fire. They are working around the clock to make that determination. We're going to continue to follow this story and bring you all the updates. For now, in Rose Township, Amira David, 7 Action News. So very sad, Amira. Thank you.